What's going on guys, Bob here back with some Bleach Online, so let's get into this today, we're going to be checking out the new events, I know I have missed quite a few days on Bleach, but uh, I was actually hoping this event would be the ultimate BP, unfortunately that's not what we got, we did get the Shinigami fun, really wish it was a lot cheaper considering the amount you have to top up, of course there is one for 200, 400, 1000, and so on and so forth. But for the best prizes, you gotta top up 20,000 gold. He has 20,000, 40,000, or 80,000, which is insane. And uh, you also have some stuff on the side, which if you top up a certain amount, you do have a chance to get coupons or gold. You usually get coupons. And then we have this event, which I haven't seen before, or at least I don't think I've seen it before. So you pick a time. I'm gonna go with 10 hours because I'm probably gonna get off after this and uh, you pick what you want in return it tells you how much you get for the hourly return so you get five of those per hour we're gonna go 10 hours and i'm gonna go with that because i actually want the pet for that so you started up uh not too sure what the free gift is it doesn't look like you can actually add more time onto it or anything like that you can see the countdown up at the top and then it also says claim gold so i guess once that's done we'll see what uh that's all about you do have to have VIP 1 or 6 or 10 but yeah and then you got uh, another character there not really liking the character it is an assault character but don't really need an assault character and then we got these boxes here which cost a hundred for one draw or a thousand for ten and then you have a chance at getting some rewards in them uh, of course I don't have any gold so I can't actually test any of this stuff and then you do have a shop of darkness and a shop of light and then you do get the talismans or the fragments of the light or dark one. And you can actually obtain characters, Zompok Toes, or whatever you're actually going for. Although they're probably pretty expensive. Uh, let's see, yeah, they're probably really expensive considering you need like 200. This one actually doesn't have anything in it. I mean, it does have some sets and stuff like that. But compared to the light one, that has all the characters and stuff. So I would probably go with that. But uh, it's up to you, honestly. And if you actually want uh, the characters in there, you can actually double up, go for the light, and actually get the other character as well. So if you're going to go that route, that's pretty good. Especially if you're going to be topping up for the Shinigami fun and stuff like that. You will have a ton of uh, gold to be using. But those are the events. Nothing too great. I know I missed the last event and uh, a little bit of the one before that so that was my bad but um yeah we didn't get anything too crazy besides the ones we got i was really really hoping for an ultimate bp just so i can actually spend my uh, vite so that we can actually start doing some stuff for some of my characters like uh, um the new vanguard we have i still need to do some of the equipment on him and I just have some other stuff I got to get done so yeah hopefully we actually get an ultimate BP pretty soon and I'm hoping that it is a Zanpakuto and hopefully it's a good one as well because I need one better than the one I have the one I have is okay everyone actually uses it um, I mean that's like the best thing you can actually get because I think they only give you like three or four so they don't really give you that many there isn't another way to actually get them besides the ultimate BP unless you're going to be topping up a ton of gold and or spending a ton of gold. So yeah, this is the only way we can actually get it. If we do actually get a pretty good one, I'll be happy. I will switch it out right away, start leveling it up. We are getting actually close to 1.3 million BP, which isn't too much. I know I'm lagging in the power, but... Uh, yeah, I can't really do too much about that considering I have to save my Vite, so I can't really use the Vite for like the Evo stuff. Um, the stars I can't really do anything with. I am actually still leveling up um, Yamamoto for my Assaulter slot, but yeah, that's going to take forever. And the stars on that character are going to take forever. I haven't even got the first star because it takes so many fragments to even get one star on him. So hopefully we actually get him done soon and I can actually start using him. Once I do actually get him up to 110, I think I'll, um, I don't know if I want to reincarnate him or not. I'll wait till the ultimate BP comes around because I do have enough to actually reincarnate another character. 
But I'm going to wait for the ultimate BP because we don't know what we're going to get. We might actually get a character and it might be pretty good. So I'll just wait, honestly, for that. Um, the sets, I haven't actually started making sets yet because I don't really want to level them. Although it would give me a little bit more BP. Plus I have uh, a lot of time to kill considering I'm barely 104 and I have to get up to 120 for the next sets. So I'm probably going to make them at some point. I did just waste a ton of... Uh, coupons on that I think I lost like 20 or 30 on that one so that kind of sucks because I gained 40 but I lost like 60 or something so yeah that really sucks and yeah that's basically about it there isn't too much to do once you get to a very high level in this you do want to have VIP 6 plus higher than that is going to help you out a lot you do want to have uh, the ability to top up a lot which I don't I haven't topped up on this game since I got VIP 4 so yeah i mean i can't really do too much i do have uh some spirit stones in my bag i don't think i have enough to actually do anything with them because most of the ones i currently have are level six plus so yeah like the strength ones all of those on the two characters that i actually use them for are currently maxed at, well they're not maxed but they're level eight and the one i have in my bag i think is level seven so yeah, I can't really do anything with uh, with that. But uh, here are the stars. We do just get... Uh, I was doing Gein before. I don't really have to do him anymore. I don't have to do Stark either. So, yeah, I guess I can just do random characters. There's Yamamoto. As you can still see, I haven't even got a star on him. Still trying. We're actually really close to, I think... It's either Yoroichi or Nail that's actually really close to another one. So, whenever they get that done, I will do that at some point. Um, yeah, I think that's basically about it. I have been forgetting to actually do the accessories lately. I don't know why. I always either forget one thing or another. Uh, I have been doing like the conquests and stuff like that. So uh, I usually do the hard version. I usually do get stuck at the end, but I still make a lot more than just doing the normal one. So that's why I do it like that. But uh, I do have to go do those later today. And I'll probably finish that off and then I got to remember to do the accessories because I keep forgetting even though I can solo it now um, sometimes I forget so I got to remember to do that because they added so much new stuff I kind of forgot about it for a while I think I hadn't done it in like a week so I do have to go remember to do that as you can see we're almost about halfway on that and once we actually get that I will be going for the four level 10 spirit stones yeah, I think I'll go for the four of them. Maybe I'll get lucky and get like an agility or power or something I can actually use. Really hoping agility, maybe wisdom or hit or something like that. So probably go for the four instead of getting like two or one. Although having a level 12 would be pretty nice, but uh, most likely it would probably be a counter or something that I don't need. So we'll see what happens with that. Yeah, for the most part, that's basically about it. I have been doing Waco Mundo. Uh, the fragments in that, I don't know what I'm actually saving up for. I think I only have a couple thousand. I really don't have that much after I leveled up now, so I don't know what I'll save up for that. Conquest, I'll do a little bit later, like I said. Uh, Mod Souls, I've just been leveling them up, honestly. I do want to try to get the um, Notorio. Uh, I forgot how to say his damn name, but uh, the one from the Waco Mundo one. So, I don't know how many fragments is that. We do get two, so that's two for ten hours. So that's uh, quite a bit, but I think I actually need like 40 of them. So, I think I can actually get it from this event. But, it is easy to upgrade those to, I think they max out at level 40 or maybe 30. And then you gotta use another like 30 or 40 fragments to actually upgrade it to get it up to a higher level. So I would have to get them around like maybe 60 to 100 of those. I don't know if I'm going to have enough for that. It does require a lot of silver, although silver is really not that big of an issue. I mean, I can get a ton of it. All I have to do is sell a bunch of stuff. So yeah, we're going to be doing that. I do have a few um, fragments in there. I don't really have any of the ones I actually need. Uh, I actually need to start getting the nail fragments for the mod so I currently only have seven uh, the pumpkin I have six of them I'm not 
even close to that one. I don't even have one yet, so there is that. But uh, yeah, we're going to be working on that. Hopefully we'll be able to get that done, but I think that's going to be about it. I know there wasn't too much in this one. Hopefully we'll get the ultimate VP on the next one. If not, hopefully sometime this month. And it better be something good so that way I can actually get it and start using my bite towards some other stuff so that way I can start increasing my BP because I'm missing quite a few of the Evo stuff on the new characters. Still haven't been able to level up some of the characters, stuff like that. So we will be working on that, but um, I think that's going to be about it. I don't know if I said, but I did get my Ryatsu up to. 56 before I was at 54 or at least in the last video so I did get two levels there I will be trying to get up to 60 in that hopefully pretty soon but that's going to be about it for this one thank you guys for watching hope you enjoyed it we'll talk to you guys later